Hey there all folks, this is Ben and welcome back to Untold Raw Secrets where we unravel the juiciest raw secrets and expose the controversial truths that the media doesn't want you guys to know. Well ladies and gentlemen, gather round as we delve in to the latest escapades of the favourite attention seekers Meghan and Prince Harry. Now I don't usually indulge in the tabloid drama but when the antics of the dynamic duo start to impact the very foundations of the charitable efforts, I find myself compelled to share a few thoughts. But hold on, before we dive into any cringeworthy moments, guys, make sure to subscribe to the channel. I've got plenty more Royal Family Revelations coming your way that, of course, you won't want to miss. So now, just a few hours after the benevolent Catherine Princess of Wales graced the screens with her sincere efforts at a food bank, enter Meghan and her puppeteer Harry. Now, I'm not here to discuss the merits of charitable work. That's a commendable endeavour for anyone. What I do want to dissect is the cringeworthy attempt by Meghan to one-up Catherine in the game. We all know Meghan loves a good competition. It seems she can't resist the urge to steal the limelight, even if it means copying someone's actions. The result, a video that on the surface showcases the raw renegades wandering around hugging people, waving all the enthusiasm of a preschool play date. However, with the conspicuous missing is a tangible evidence of actual work. So, handed, but where does it come from? Where We're going to find out the genuine donations or where they're mere props that Megan was using in a charade. The lack of charity left viewers scratching their head like the donors who couldn't decipher whether their hard-earned money was actually going. But that's not the only issue here. Reports suggest that Megan and Harry are clocking in a grand total of one hour per week towards their charitable endeavours. One hour. Now, call me old-fashioned, but that doesn't sound like the tireless dedication one expects from the faces of a charitable foundation. It seems like the royal couple has yet to grasp the concept that you need to work to earn those millions in donations. And speaking of millions, let's not forget that their foundation, Arel, is bleeding money. December, the season of giving came and went, but the anticipated flood of donations never arrived. Why? Well, perhaps it has something to do with the glaring lack of transparency and accountability. Donors want to know where their money is going, and Meghan and Harry seem incapable of providing answers. Now, here's where the plot thickens. Instead of learning from their missteps, Meghan and Harry are doubling down. Rumour has it that they're cooking up another video, another attempt to tug at the heartstrings of potential donors. But let me be clear, this won't be a redemption arc. No, my friends, brace yourself for something worse than the first cringe fest. The Royal Renegades are desperately trying to salvage their tainted brand. But their ship is sinking faster than you can say, where did the donations go? The public is sceptical and rightly so. They want to see genuine efforts, not just a carefully choreographed performance. So what's your take on all of this, guys? Let me know what you think down in the comments, of course. And that's all for today's jaw-dropping revelations. We'll see you next time for more Royal News and Analysis. Bye for now.